Yes. Which of your sister? Rita. She was knocked down by a car yesterday. And she's admitted at St. Charles Hospital with two legs. Oh, my baby, I'm so sorry. So, how is she feeling now? Well, well she's getting better. But I got to go see her at the hospital now. Can I go with you? Sarah. Sarah. 
Sarah. Sarah, Sarah, Sarah. Come on. Ah. What's on your mind? I'm so sorry. You didn't even notice me when I came in. It's just this exam thing. I'm just tired of going to write exam as far as London, England. Yeah, but we've been ready for this exam, I know. Transport University is one of the best universities in the world. I know. It's just that I'm going to miss you for one month when I'm gone. So for me too, baby. I'm going to miss you really good. I want you to do me proud, okay? I want you to be one of the best students in the university. I will, yeah. Trust me. I'm famished I could use a drink. Can I get a glass of wine? Okay. Yeah. Was really tasty. <laughs> you know what? <clears throat> I'll get the money for you tomorrow morning. I'll bring it on your face. All right. And uh, please, please, I will be grateful if those files are the best in the country and abroad. Oh, trust me, Mr. Maro, you're going to get the best of the best. All right, thanks for the speech. It was a nice one. Mm, thank you very much. I'll be expecting the morning tomorrow morning. It's all right, it's okay. Have a wonderful day. And you too. Bye bye. Bye. Bye bye. Hi, but that doesn't mean I shouldn't say hello. So, hi, business. Yes, it's fine. Anyway, where is my dress? Did I promise you today? Doris. Oh, I forgot. I'm sorry. Wait a minute. <laughs> Is it my dress you're looking for?
Don't worry, I'm coming. You shower now. So you can't even keep my dress separate from this one. This is your crush. No, that is not my dress. Oh! I forgot, I forgot. This is your one. Okay. This is your one. Guys, please, I'm in a hurry. Just give me the dress and let me go. Doris is Sharon. Why can't you just keep my dress separately? I'm coming. Have your pass. Thank you. Like I said, I'm in a hurry. I have to leave now. Oh, I rush up now, but please, I like that jewelry, yeah? You keep okay. it for me. Okay, bye-bye. Have a nice day. Bye. <laughs> Wildlife sitcom and drama, emotional cliffhangers, reality TV at its best. The difference? The actors, African wildlife. The set, the African bush. The script writer and producer, Mother Nature. Last time on Wildlife Diary, Zero struggled to dominate Luma. The wild dog pups gave the hyenas a lesson in courage. Nimble bush babies got the better of Tishinga's cubs. And Lolly's expanding girth revealed some welcome news. Where's your friends? I don't know. Where's your friend? I don't know. Why are you coming after us? <laughs> Different day, same problem, huh, Lincoln? Well, you know how this turned out when LJ was in this position, and today is no different. So be a good boy and put down the gun. Come on, Link. I know you learned your lesson. <laughs> You're right. I have.
I'll be reporting to Brother Mario. You can report me on your want. I really don't care. Hmm? Angela, you are spoiling something with your tap like actions. And I want to tell you, this is the last time I will see you in this house. Do you understand? Yes. yes. Now get out! <laughs> Angela! Angela, please come back! I came to see your sister Sarah. Oh, yeah. she's gone up? Yeah, she's gone up. Um, gone to school, I guess. Yeah, I need to talk to you though. I have uh, good news for you. Really? Yeah, but we have to talk about it inside. Your sister is not inside. Oh, don't worry. I won't take much of your time. Let's go inside, okay? Yeah, let me just pop up. Right it's okay.
Hello, Mario. Hello, Rita. Hey, this is Tiny Jane. She's standing in front of the TV. She's lying, no, brother. She refused to give me food. Will you shut up? Are you a baby? Can't you go to the kitchen and make something for yourself? Rita, you know I can't cook. And you won't even teach me how to cook. Because you're not serious. Big thing like you can't cook. 